It's back to school week here on Twin Cities Live, and that means it's time for a change and a fresh start. We asked the Twin Cities Live ambush makeover team to find an incoming college freshman to make a big, huge change. And as Twin Cities Live producer Kelly Hansen shows us, we're getting exactly what we asked for. You always see me walking around Ridgedale, hoofing it, trying to find somebody to ambush makeover. Well, today, it's a little more relaxing because thanks to an email, we already found our girl. It's time for a college makeover. In just a few weeks, Elizabeth Moy is moving out and moving into dorm life on the U of M campus. But before that, we're helping her make a big change. I've never really taken the time to do anything really drastic, so I guess now, better now than never, I guess. T-shirt shorts, is that kind of your summer go-to? Yeah, pretty much. Just whatever's clean and on top of the pile on the way out the door <laughs> in the morning. Spoken like a true college student, but first, it's time to get into the fitting room at Lynn. Okay, we have never had this happen on Twin Cities Live for an ambush makeover. Elizabeth brought her entourage. Hi, everyone. Hey. We've got mom, grandma, aunt, brother, sister, even baby Lucia joined us today. We've got outfit number one on. I love this look on you. It's a little more casual, but we've dressed it up with a scarf. What do you think? I mean, it's definitely doable. I've had scarves before, but they're more of the single color, non-pattern simple scarf and so this with different patterns different colors all thrown in there and an infinity scarf is something exciting something different i love this top it screams let's go out and have a great time yeah. what do you think about it yeah i've never really been a ruffle fan but i like the ruffles on it, it gives it a little playful yeah. feel and you're so petite the skinny jean again this would look great with a sweater and some boots i think totally for the fall we finally found the one. Then we headed off to find shoes at Aerosol. Elizabeth has never had her eyebrows waxed, but today it's all about change. New reflection stylist Neil Berkeley has a few shortcuts in mind. Here's the important thing about hair. It doesn't matter how much is on the floor. It's what stays on the hair that's the only important part. So it doesn't matter how much you cut off. Easier said than done for the girl who always wears her hair in a ponytail. Oh, Deep breath. I know, I know. <laughs> I found some product at Neil's station. It's actually Aveda for men. And you use this in Elizabeth's hair. Why would you use a man's product in her hair? Um, because men generally don't want their hair big, full, and fluffy. So if you use it on hair, it tends to dry big, full, and fluffy. It tends to dry more like fit it to the head like a man's hair would like. Several hours later, the big moment is here. Got the family here. We've been waiting all afternoon. Are you excited? Oh, yes. Okay, all right. So the big moment's here on the count of three. We're all going to turn around and see Elizabeth. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, my gosh. I like it. Oh, my gosh. That is so great. What do you think? You, you had a great reaction. <laughs> I couldn't recognize it. Isn't it beautiful? It's beautiful. Really, she looks so grown up. She does. She looks like she's ready to go to college. <laughs> <laughs> Don't cry. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I feel like a different person. I never thought I could step so far out of my comfort zone and be okay with it. Lynn hooked Elizabeth up with a chambray shirt paired with a black skinny jean and some fun accessories. And aerosols took it up a notch with a great pair of booties. And I hear you have a boyfriend. Yes. Okay, yes, well, I do. he might have some competition. I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> yeah, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. <laughs> you look beautiful. Thanks so much. Thank you. Doesn't you look great? Yeah, she looks great. A hey, big thanks to Ridgedale Center and New Reflection Salon for sponsoring Twin Cities Live. Call the number on your screen to schedule an appointment at any of New Reflection's salon locations. They have three locations, Ridgedale Center, Plymouth, and Maple Grove. And I want to mention, I'm hanging out right now with some teachers who are all Gustavus alums. So, thank you all for being here. And uh, 